Hello, yeah, my name is Matt and welcome to Trains and we are going to show you how to drive a steam locomotive. Yes. Hello, Edward. <laughs> oh, I just recently got the model. It is fantastic. But here I'm going to show you how to drive a steam locomotive. You know, when you first get trains, on most models you get to learn how to drive a diesel and then an electric model. But now, they don't really normally show you how to drive a steam locomotive and there's a few tutorials on that. So, I'm actually here to give you a helping hand. Hello, Edward. Let's move out. Ah, isn't he adorable? Look at my face. Look at my, look at my face. <laughs> look at my face. Look at my face. Anyway, so, this is a quick drive. It normally tells you how, which uh, version you want to do. So, easy mode. That on the bottom just shows up. It's very simple. Everyone knows how to use it, but here we're going to go on to realistic mode. <laughs> yes, we got it. Kick to mash. So, what we're going to do in this episode, you may ask. Well, Edward is going to go up, up that line and then cover onto those coaches and go up onto the next uh, station. Yes, that's what it's called. So, first of all, let's have a look around. Ah, oh, isn't he adorable? Anyway, let's um, not go into um, what it looks like. It's all about how to prepare the locomotive. So, anyway, so let's go up on here. And I'll chase you, cab interior mode. Oh, sexy beast. Sexy beast. Sorry. <laughs> it is. Wow. You can sign that word. It's exciting. Right, so, so let's anyone, anyway, here, let's go down here, and um, I'll, we'll go through uh, some of the uh, controls. Right, so, this one goes backwards and forwards, this, so, okay, you want to go backwards and forwards, basically. So, we want to go forward first. Now, the difference is, like, on a steam locomotive, is that um, whilst it's going, it uses a coal and water to actually make steam so it could pressure, pressure it. Right, on to um, the pistons to make the wheels move. Now, quite obviously what is the steam locomotive is all about briefly. But, um, but anywho, while well, as it goes, let's see, let, up here, I know my mouse is not very good. So you might might see something else. So uh, blame for my computer screen for that, so sorry. But if you look somewhere up here, along Long. If you try and find coal and water, could you find coal, coal level and water? Water now is 61% and the coal level is 86. That's quite good. But uh, for now, we are gonna let's have a look. We don't have enough water, so we want to put some more water in. Let's do that. And it's going up 62, 63, 64, 65. 66 and uh, 67. Now, well, well, if you don't do this, then um, halfway around the journey, you'll begin to notice that your train is beginning to slow down and they will shut off. Why? It's because uh, you haven't shown enough coal and water and you're out of water, so then you have to put more in. Well, that's enough water, so go down, steady go, that's it. Now, we've got the train brake on here. Hold on, I'm going to try and move it. There it is, there's the train brake. Now we're going to release the brake. Okay. Now, if I... Tr we have a look a bit around. Is there a lever? There should be a lever. Where's the lever? Hmm. Well. Well, if I move this around, then... It No, I can't find it. No, I don't. Did you saw anything move? Hmm. Alright. Let's try and pull this. No, nothing happened. Alright, well, when you press H on your keyboard, that's the whistle. I don't know why it's H. It's because it's a shortcut for horn, but it's a, a whistle. 
It's a lovely whistle. Yes. Oh, by the way, let's uh, go go out. Free running few. And the uh, point are set. Good old chase few. You know what? I'm gonna go back into the cab, and we're gonna make make Edward go off. Now let's have a look. The uh, the train brake is all down. He's got plenty plenty of cold water and water. So let's. Whoa, we're moving. We move this. Oh, can I move? Can't I? Oh, you. Okay, I can't tell, so I'm just gonna go back into the chase. You. Oh, he moves like very fast. And break on! Good lord, what have I done? <laughs> oh dear. Well, he, he, he is quite very fast. I was not expecting that. Maybe we saw the cold. Do you, do you have Henry's cold? Mischief. Very powerful. It's very good for you. Right, okay, we get that. Alright, so we're going to go backwards. All right, we're going slow. No, well, we were going slowly. Carry on. Hello, Edward on the line. Yes, I've changed the point. Now, the reason why, hold on. Maybe it's not. Well, there's a reason why, because how he wants it would just slow down so when he couples up towards the coaches. I heard there was an animated feature when you couple up towards the coaches. And that's quite nice, that's quite neat. This is actually my first time on Edward. But don't worry, I have driven driven a steam locomotive before and that was Spencer. And he was awesome. So, the uh, the train brake, the one right next to the power, is quite powerful, quite sharp. So, when Edward is right next towards the coaches, I am going to apply the brakes immediately. He is there. Uh, now. Perfecto. Alright, now that is gone only because it's telling us right, the passengers are getting that so awesome. This is the station that has passengers. And we get, oh hold on, oh no, holy hoody. And we get some animated drivers. No, drivers? What? What's wrong with me? It's a driver environment. They're animated, and that's lovely. It's lush. Lushy lovely. Right, hold on. Right, let's turn. Whoa, turn around. And I'm gonna go into the map. Hold on, I just is check if there's any points that. Yes, it's called Oaks Junction. Whoa. Yeah, well, right. I'm go back into map. View. Whoa! That that one that way. Change view. Right, so it looks like we're all right. So I am gonna go back into cab. I love the inside, it's gorgeous, it's lush. 
No one to see a garbage truck going on. Right. So I'm ready to depart. And I'm gonna press W. I'm gonna press W. Oh no, wait, I can't. Alright, I'm gonna press W. No, I think you can't do it on this. Ah, that explains that I haven't put the back. Oh, it was going quite fast. He is quite jumpy, isn't he? Oh, right, come on, let's go. Oh, right, let's go. Still, it's quite awesome. But he's quite sensitive. The uh, the power's sensitive. Uh, if you do it in top notch, I bet he would do a hundred. Come on, chew. Let's see. The water seventy one percent. Coal level four. Oh, he's doing quite well. Chase you. He's going off a good start. He would kick Gordon's ass, wouldn't he? Bye bye, Gordon. Right. You know, this is only just to uh, show you how to actually drive a steam locomotive. And Edward is a perfect example, but he he's going quite fast, going whew. I know he's not going that quite fast, so I say, oh my god, he's doing 21 kilometers per hour. Joy. That's nearly like 10 miles per hour. To the power notch a bit. Choo choo. Uh oh, we're gonna go into the tunnel. I'm gonna actually. No. Yeah, I'm gonna. See this part up. Because we don't want to face into inside the tunnel at all times and we got a floating tree. Okay, floating tree. <sighs> well that's physics for you. Right. Where's the end of the tunnel? Turn around. Aha. It's not quite a long tunnel, it's not too long. Run. And every year, <laughs> but it's not dark. Edward, Eddie, oh good God, here I am. Hey, <laughs> Kev, Kev, Kev. Like an episode. Like it's, it's quite jumpy. Ah, that's better. For a minute then, I thought it was going to be ending up like one of Train Boy 961 videos. <laughs> Get their reference. No, they don't. I'm going to press F5 and you could do this. Quite nice. Look at this, a Thomas episode. Actually, I'm gonna press F five once more. Oh, God, thirty-three. Come along, come along, come along. All right, don't fast. All right, don't fast. I'm a really useful engine. Oh yes, this is the face that you wanna see before you die on the rails. Hello, everyone. <laughs> oh dear Lord. I kind of image of my skull. Ah, that's better. I'll press five once more on the C. I'm not pressing five. Yeah. Five, that's better. This is a yellow route that I've done quite a long time ago. It was an attempt and 
yes, it's going to be part of a future video. Oh, look, a windmill! It's Thomas and his friends. Right, I'm going to turn, turn the power down. Next signal red, I do not know why. Oh, I think I know. It's because at the po the points out outside the station, not the not our side where we're coming in, is um going to onto the uh, junction onto another line. So jump it down. We won this. Uh, I want to make a good attempt. Oh, Thirteen. I'm gonna press the whistle. Hello, we're here. I know we're doing quite slow, but still, hey, it's a steam locomotive. It's a kettle. And wheels. Oh, how fun. Doing eleven. That's a break. You gotta make it steady. Steady, oh boy. Yay! Well, we're from a tree. We did it! We did it! We did it! We did it! Yay! Well, that's quite a good shot. And that's basically it. Yeah, we're not going to do the whole line, but hey, we done a task. So, that is how you drive a steam locomotive, or basically Edward. I want to say thank you towards, I think it's 3D Soda item for this model and its rolling stock. Thank you so much and thank you for watching this video. I hope you go out and enjoy yourself to drive a steam locomotive. Not a real one, don't, don't make me a witness for the police. Bye and goodbye.